hello everyone welcome or welcome back to my channel today's video i just wanted to show you guys what i do before i go on a trip without the ferrets because i'm going to visit my cousins in california tomorrow until monday i honestly don't even know when we're coming back monday or tuesday but my brother is going to be watching the little weenie beans and so there's just a few things that i do to just make sure that everything goes smoothly when I'm not here because I am a paranoid ferret mother and so I just want to make sure that everything is taken care of. And so as I was recording this, I didn't even know that Pina was still out of the cage. I thought that she like put herself to sleep and look, there was a weenie girl this whole time. This is what the room looks like at the moment. It is pretty messy. I may or may not have let it get this messy on purpose just because I knew that I wanted to do like a big cleanup before I left anyway. So I figured I would kind of just let it get a little bit messy and then I would clean and do everything all at once. So first we're just organizing their little corner, like all their food and where their medicine is and things like that. Now Ellie is so kindly helping me sweep a little bit. The reason why we're cleaning the room is because Sammy won't be here because she's going to... California. California, so she, she won't be here. To, to, she's going to see her cousins, so she won't be here. So we are cleaning the room. Nick, which is her brother, and me are going to be looking after them until she gets back. Wait, until she gets back. Now I am just doing some more organizing, some more cleaning, and Ellie will explain to you guys in a few seconds what Pina just did. Guys, can you see all this stuff on the floor? Guess who made this mess? That daredevil. She knocked this over and everything was on it. Yeah. Like everything. And then... Ta-da, beautiful, fresh, organized for the next step that I will show you guys later on in this video. First, I put a little salmon oil on their bellies and then I clip their nails. I wanted to clip their nails just in case. I'm like such a paranoid mother, so just in, make sure to avoid any potential their nails getting stuck on anything this weekend. I just wanted to make sure that they got a little fresh manicure before I left. I also got them some new hammocks and beds because their favorite bed ever, the little gray one that I have, is from Shein. So I just wanted to check what else Shein had and I ended up getting them a bunch of things. And yeah, now I'm just putting them all in the cage. I cleaned the entire cage out and I'm gonna put fresh clean stuff so they have a brand new clean cage. So I got them all this cute new stuff. I got them this cute little, I can't, don't even know if this is a strawberry or a peach. No, definitely not a strawberry. Maybe a peach, a cute little peach hammock. This one they've had, change their weenie pads. Kitty though. <laughs> Hello, handsome. I got them this little blue, fun quilted looking hammock. Their towel and, the, oh, this little fuzzy blanket. And look at this bed. It's an upgrade from, this is all the dirty stuff, but it's an upgrade from their little one right here. Look at how long this one is. It's so cute and so fluffy. I'm so jealous of them. Right, handsome boy? Kitty Dale already loves this cozy little blanket. He's still licking the salmon oil off of his widow belly. Now I'm going to do their laundry of all the dirty things that were in the basement, their old bedding and things like that. So that way I don't have to worry about it needing to do it when I get back or having any dirty stuff down there. I can just do it right now before I leave. It's so funny how the bed looks so big. They're just like flopped on the bottom. But there's my little Narnar and my Jinxie. Now, here comes the really fun part, yay! I took away all their old dirty wee pads and I'm going to sweep everything. And now I am going to mop it, yay! So much fun, love it, sarcasm, sarcasm, can you tell? This 
is just a little example of what it is like living with ferrets. So I clean underneath this bed probably like once every few days. And this is what we have back here so far. We have a water bottle, two toys, a spoon, some papers, and a lot of crumbs because they love to bring their food down here. All clean wee wee pads. Everything is clean over here. The water bottles. All fresh and clean. Wee wee pads over here. Clean the entire floor. Cleaned over here. The baby's cage is already. I should have put them back just to mop and stuff. Cleaned all this. Everything is clean. Added new wee wee pads over here in this corner in these corners <laughs> and yeah one last random thing that i want to show you guys that i did was i just marked this little syringe to make his life easier the pink one is what jinxie gets and the black line is what narnar -nar gets Okay, so yeah, that is it. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. I hope that it showed you guys what I have to do when I go on a trip. So yeah, that's all I really got.